Chris Paul with McCollum on him as we start things off for the Phoenix Suns. Aiton has had a terrific series, and Valanchun is there. Chris Paul averaging 20 and 10 in this series. Shot clock at four. Jones on Booker. Crowder puts up a shot. That is a three. McCollum was there. Who's had double doubles in four of the five games? He's working right into Aiden. Here is Ingram. Didn't have the greatest game five. Cutting his hay right to the rack in his aggressive play, especially in the first. I love the ball movement here yeah. by the Pelicans. Everyone touching the basketball. They only had 14 assists. Chris Paul, mid range. Jay put in. He's got two. Yep. But Hayes kind of hurt that ankle or left knee on that shot. Aiton over Valanciunas. We've seen this all series from Aiton. Being able not only to chew up from that free throw line area. Valanciunas going high and up there is Hayes. And may have caught the Suns a little bit by surprise coming up. Being able to distribute the basketball. Averaging at least four assists a game. Paul again. This is over Hayes and two at two begins Chris Paul. He began well. Yeah, shot the ball well at all. He's played good, but he hasn't played great. They're going to need a great game if they want to continue to keep playing. A couple screens by Aiden knocked out the defense of Ingram and Phoenix. Ingram, not as devastating self in game five, but he gets that pass off to Valanciunas, who takes it in and slices for two. Well, the Suns team has gone to the finals. There's a deflection and steal there by Herbert Jones. And down to Hayes, the early release. And we saw this kind of play. Six of the eight points by Hayes, and now if your head coach, Willie Green, a lot of times their best, especially from deep from that three-point line, making 10, about 37%, coming in 29% from downtown. Well, in game uh, five, they hit 10, and that was huge. Valanciunas with the fake, and Aiden is there. There's no hedge, and the shot clock down to five. McCollum defended by Bridges. He did a great job on both McCollum and Ingram. Ingram with a three. Puts it up and in. Brandon Ingram with the trade. And Junis already has three rebounds. McCollum takes it up and through. Six and a half to go. And the Pelicans have tied on. After that slow start shooting, but their defense has sparked their offense here in that 9-2 run. Oh, oh, down Junis let Aiden get free underneath. What a pass by C. Ingram and Aiden. Shot clock at five. Rotating it around McCollum. A fake, a drive, and a floater on the fly for McCollum. Got his own miss. He's been the best rebounding guard in the playoffs. A middle shot with follow. And McCollum being on is huge. And he's going to continue to stay aggressive. We talked about him not shooting the basketball great in this series. It's Aiton. Three he's good. of three for DeAndre Aiton. The Phoenix Suns have brought in Cameron Johnson, who has started the last couple games in place of Booker. Here comes Ingram. Bridges right there. Bridges did a terrific job on Ingram in game five. Off that baseline, trapping is Jones. That is a foul. Count the two, and the foul goes on. Nice question. How many assists plus fields with Chris Paul? Because he's going to have at least... 12 assists. Close on game for the Suns, leading three games to two. Crowder hit a three, has missed a couple since. Ball getting now, uh, wicked on that baseline. Here comes Aiton, who has not missed on all of his shots. Four of four with a couple. Up. His footwork, great hands. McCollum aggressive with his shot. Got it! Fouled! Count the two and send him to the line. Well, for Pelican fans and Willie Green, and we spoke with... In for Willie Green, usually it's been Devontae Graham, the first guard off the bench tonight. It's the rookie out of Georgia Tech has come in for Phoenix. And usually with Willie Green, he goes with Alvarado first at home because it's defense that he needs. On the road, normally it's offense, and that's why you go with Devontae Graham. It is on that baseline, circling Cameron Johnson. With a long shot, it is a triple, and he hits his first off for size. This is a young man who had about three or four wide open threes in that game five and just couldn't seem to get it to go. It's Alvarado. Down goes Payne with the move and a floater on the fly. Alvarado puts it in as Bridges tried to hatch it his way inside. 
It's Ingram. Murphy for three. Rookie from UVA can't get it. There's Alvarado getting the rebound, and Ingram has it, and Bridges is there to meet him, of course. Runner up for the defensive player in the year. Chiseling his way in, Brandon Ingram. And that's absolutely great defense by Bridges. Just outstanding offense by Ingram. Using that length. Game five, won by the Suns, 112 to 97. Chris Paul having 16 in the first half. Shannon, he scored well the other night. So did Payne, a floater off that baseline, no. Rebound by Ingram. That Pelicans lost by 15 in game five, trailed by 18, but got as close as seven late in the game. Tuesday night in Phoenix. It's McCollum off a screen. Bridges goes to meet him. Bad hands and all. Ingram has it. Shot clock at four. Johnson defends. Caught by Payne. Oof. The other way. Cameron Johnson. Holding his head, hit the deck. Wicked fall down yeah. low, and Shannon is and off. Alvarado yep. is kind of having words Another down here. Coaching staff of Phoenix is all run onto the floor. Watch it again. Heavy bump there by McCollum. And the head hit the wood. And we step aside in New Orleans. Straight Talk Wireless.